Hello Sagittarius, thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to be doing a reading for you today. It's going to be something that you don't expect, but it would benefit you to expect it. What do we have for Sagittarius? Okay, Page of Swords. Show me more. Ten of Cups. Interesting. Um, there's someone who is like... Now they like watch your family on social media or they like watch you enjoying something or being fulfilled on social media or um they watch you like being happy okay they they want to know what's going on with you and all the information they get is that you're happy okay Interesting. Show me more. Someone could be kind of invasive, like they have a right to like seek information on you or um I don't know. Like they don't see the problem with like I don't know, keeping so close tabs on you. Hey Parker, what are you doing? Alright, the Seven of Cups has been coming out a lot today. wants to reach out to you or wants to come towards you but I don't know something's holding them back okay some of you guys might be in a relationship someone wants to move towards you this could be a water sign or you might be a water sign watching for a Sagittarius Somebody is like this, somebody like thinks you have too many options or um, you have a lot going on, okay? You're not thinking of them. This is what someone thinks. It could be true. It could just be what they're thinking. What are they looking for? What are they spying for? What are they keeping tabs for? giving this person like energy or attention or they find it hard to find information on you interesting <laughs> okay someone could be trying to spiritually spy okay because they don't have access to you in the 3d You're stingy with your energy, okay? You keep it for yourself. You're not just handing your energy out to anyone and everyone. People can't bully you into... into... feeding into them is what I'm getting, or like... giving to them. Okay. Show me more about this for Sagittarius.
I don't know. This is such a weird vibe because it's like someone feels like you have you have enough going on or you're fulfilled without them or you don't need them. You don't want them. You don't want to give them energy. You don't want to tell them what's going on. You don't want to feed into them. You don't want to you don't want to give to them. And they feel like I can't I don't they feel like, oh, I don't have access to Sagittarius or vice versa if you're cross watching. But like it, but they're still trying to keep tabs. I'm getting that they don't they don't have access to or they you don't. I'm kind of getting you don't want anything to do with them. You're living your own life. So they're right. They're right. You have your life going on. OK, you have a family even or a business, something you're fulfilled. You're living a dream. Or you're going to be living a dream. Someone's like, they have enough options, they don't want me, but I'm getting that's true. It doesn't necessarily have to be, but this is what someone is telling themselves. You could be married or you're getting married. Someone isn't allowed at the wedding. This is like, I don't know, this is a little bit stalkerish, okay? It's giving me Joe Goldberg vibes. We have the Nine of Cups. Someone truly wants to make an offer to you. Someone truly wants to reach out to you, though. Or there's someone that wants to, to reach out to you, the King of Swords. Someone's all in their head, overthinking. Very confused. Someone wants to be one of your options. I'm getting also someone's like, I, I've changed. I'm getting that you've moved on from this person, though. Um... Is there anything else about this for Sagittarius? Okay, something about invisible ink. Okay, we have the Seven of Swords. And I'm hearing January, whatever the hell that means. We have the Ten of Swords falling in my lap. I don't know, someone might, um, someone might, like, become, like, cold or spiteful, okay, or vengeful or whatever. Because you're not, you, they're not in your life, you've moved on, you, I don't know, you have a family, you have a business, you're living your best and someone is spiteful, someone might try to retaliate or come at you with this Seven of Swords energy, but they're shut down immediately, Ten of Swords. They're just, you know, that's it. Someone might have been kind of trying to hide the fact that they want more access to you. This might be even someone that you do give a little bit of access to them. This would be if that person is a friend, okay? But you find out something, you find out, I don't know. They go too far with something and that's the end of them. That's the last chance that they got or something like that. Um, for some of you, this is someone who was able to manipulate you in the past, but no longer. Okay, Sagittarius. Um, okay, let me ask. Is there anything else for Sagittarius? Temperance. 
Sagittarius energy. Okay, something gets better with time. Someone's really in their head, and this is this this is something they they've had to deal with for a long time, or they will have to deal with for a long time. Until someone realizes something, I'm hearing until someone wakes up or realizes something about themselves, they're going to be stressing, okay? Interesting. This could be an earth sign. Feminine energy doesn't have to be. I said earth sign, but I want to say Gemini, Libra, Aquarius person. Um, they don't have to be female, but it's feminine energy. We also have masculine energy, though. And um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. There's some like last straw moment or like last chance that someone gets moment type of thing going on. Okay. Thank you, Sagittarius. If this resonated, I hope it provided you with guidance and clarity on your situation. So much love to you as you move through it. And yeah, bye.